Hey, what's up Twitch, YouTube? This is your boy Xbox Frequency bringing you Saturday Night War Room with General Freak. Hoping I've played a few games tonight, but hopefully we're going to get a good five player game here. I'm really, really hoping for that more than anything right now. <laughs> John Paul, four stream, let's go. Hey, why not? It's Saturday night, man. I rather, honestly, I'd rather be streaming than just, you know, I actually just enjoy streaming a lot. It's, it's like, honestly, almost even more exciting than, <laughs> like, obviously going out is fun and stuff like that, but it's just like, I'd rather just kind of, kind of play Risk and chill and stream, honestly. I definitely don't want to make this start up just yet, guys. So just give me a moment here. I just got to use the washroom real quick. Just give me a moment. I'll be right back. Uh, and hopefully we get a game going here. All right. I'll be back momentarily, guys. Just hold on a second.
into the war room. I am Iris, your integrated reconnaissance and intelligence system. The world is at war. Your objective is to defeat your... The order of play is being determined. Yellow player goes first. Setup complete. Yellow player, draft phase. All right, guys, I'm back. I'm really sorry about that, but I am back. All right, let's see what's going on here. Wow. See, I don't even know who went. Who did it start on? Maybe... Oh, no. It just started on yellow here. Okay. Ooh, ouch. Big risk, you know. You know what I mean? I'm kind of getting drawn South America, Blue's got North America. You no. Know. I think Yellow has Africa. Yellow should make a, a claim for Africa here. White should have Europe. You know, blue should have North America. I should have South America. And red should have Australia. You know, it's whoever has the most and most dominant position. Like, I could fight, maybe. <clears throat> See, it almost... See, red's after me, too, right? But if this was a super competitive match, like I would definitely. Like I would definitely just take South America here. And be fair, you know what I mean? He has that two in Southeast Asia, India. In Australia, he has one more troop than me. You know what I mean? I have a good situation in South America, right? Like, it's just kind of... It's like the balance of power, right? <clears throat> you're all draw You're randomly drawn a certain territory every game, right? Or a certain continent every game. Right. And it's like you almost have to analyze that when you first start a game, like... Who has the most justification in what continent, right? Where's your home? Where do you... Beautiful. That telepat, Tay, I know, I know I've seen him. I've played with him before, sure. Before. For sure, sorry. Jeez, it's getting late now. I'm. That's awesome that you guys are still tuning in. I, I, I really respect that, guys. Thanks. I. Uh... So what's yeah? Oh, okay. See what I could do here is see how yellow's kind of saying I want Europe now. Well, might as well give white the gate out. I see someone's tuned into the stream. Nice of you to tune in. Thanks for tuning in. So, I have South America, or I'm, I was basically drawn South America, double star to start off the game, that's nice. Um, yeah, no, basically I'm just going to give him, give him the gate here. No. 
know, it makes sense for him to want move. He's got his easy star, and then he can move him into Africa. Because that's what he's got to be thinking now. Like, thinking that yellow. Like, if I was white and I was... And that just happened to me, like, it's a no-brainer, right? Right, he just... Red's gonna slowly <clears throat> secure it. And I just don't want to give him an easy one. I don't want to give him to him easy, right? I might as well just leave him how it is, three and two. I see someone's tuned into the stream. Shy Mangle 2003. This is the first time you're seeing me stream? All right, on, man. I'm glad you finally tuned in. You're welcome, man. Thank you for the support. No, thank you. Thank you, actually. No, thank you. I'm glad you could you could uh, you could tune into the, the the stream, man. I've been uh, I've been playing all night. I've been playing all night. So I'm glad you uh, tuned in. So that's huge. Shy Mangle 2003, I'm guessing you're from YouTube, right? your daddy tells you move them out i better not be in a better i just want to check if i'm still in my own party yeah i am i gotta i gotta watch for that sometimes it kicks me out of the party and then my opponents can hear me come on man you gotta move these out i don't know what he's saying. oh no Oh my god. Come on, man. Really? All you had to do is move a moment. That's all you had to do. I just don't get it. I don't like this. 15 minutes in AI already. Don't like that. I guess he did still move him out. Even to the AI, it must have been a no-brainer. <clears throat> so blue trying to pick up a star here somewhere. Wow, he's gonna go there. I thought he would for sure go on the two. It's all good. He's just taken. I like it actually, but that's a tight play on Blue's part. He just wanted his easy one. He wants a star. He'll move those up. He'll get him into North America eventually. He's no rush. You know, I like I like that. I can. I think Blue is playing that smart. You know what? There's no, <clears throat> there's no reason risking it. Yeah. Leave the two there. There's no reason. 
If I lose two there, then I have like a weak South America, you know? It's just two extra in the long run. It's not a big deal. i rather have it... Like, I'd put, rather play really tight and just get that three extra and then hold it for sure next turn. Then in people's minds, I'm not being too greedy. Wow! Red losing a ton there. You say, Shy Mangle, you said you were just playing? Having issues closing the deals? That means you were just playing Risk and you had issues like getting a W? Is that what you were saying? Could you specify a bit more? Yeah. I see you got that sad face, John Paul, probably when I said the AI so early, right? AI, that's right. Hmm. Let's see what the white AI does here. Yeah, the white AI, you know what I mean? No reason for white to bail there. by the white AI. So blue trading in here, probably they get this. I'll get some. Now we can, yeah, bring those out though, right? That's exactly what he does. Oh, I think when I was double checking if I was still in the party chat. Yeah, I didn't know, like... It was just weird there. Oh, okay, I gotcha. I just didn't want him to think that was like rude or something or like rage quit, but no, he couldn't hear me. So, playing a little safe. Waiting to get my continent. Alright, I'll end my turn there. Six and six. And the laugh out loud was from before the rage quit. Oh, I got you. Yeah, it just happened then that steps. I got you. So yeah, sorry, Shy Mangle, that's what, I am correct on that. Issue timing. Yeah, it issues timing when to attack. Yeah, it's hard, man. It's hard. Sometimes you gotta be really patient, I find. Yeah, it's, it's tough, man. Like, you gotta be really patient. You learned a lot from my vids. Yeah, thanks, man. I appreciate it. Yeah. All right, it's hard, man. Even for me, like to time the right attack, you don't know how people are going to react in certain ways. Right, you're always playing against different players. Right, you don't want to set the vendetta off too early on someone, right? And then they just hit you. That's why I just kind of like to avoid take what's mine. Forty-five 
And just try to get, just stay away from the aggro players. Do moves that are not going to ag aggravate people or make the aggressive people come. And it's hard. It is hard picking the moment to attack, right? So wait, hilarious. Like this could be white, a human player, you know what I mean? And we could be having a textbook South America game, but come on, put it on a fast AI. Man, this kills me, this slow AI. Gotta do the fast AI. Oh. Alrighty. This is still a pretty good game though, I you know. Even though we had the rage quitter early. Like blue's gonna get North America soon, yellow's gonna get Europe. Maybe white's gonna I like the not being too greedy. Dang. That's not good because he's going to pick it up next turn for sure. See, but that's okay. I want that. Well, I want yellow to have Europe. here I'm gonna bulk up that force out in Asia right because I need I need it I love it already cinnamon Siberia right five different territories that connect draw for your easy stars <laughs> it's just like this is like my textbook South America gameplay is like sit them a uh, force in Siberia, make sure it's a half decent force, and you need that there when you have South America, hundred percent. I just realized that from playing so much, I'm just like Siberia makes the most sense to hold them. It's deep, northern Asia. It's no threat to Australia. You know what I mean? So red trading in there, getting a strong Australia now. Okay, 13 and 3. So yellow 5 stars here. You could trade in and get a very fortified Europe. So that's a good thing is... You could almost get it here, too. Yikes, you could easily get it here. 
nice, but I like it, you know what I mean? I would, like, I also like the slow play in it, right? <laughs> What's going on here? All right. It's <laughs> just like the cycling, the cycling, and then the back out. Check and balance between Europe and North America. Yeah. You always like to see that. They're both going to take it next turn. You know what I mean? I like this. South America, Australia are taken. A few turns after that, Europe and North America. But as long, even if they're immediately like they are, as long as they both gain power at the same time, right? Because theoretically, if they both gain power at the same time, they're going to turn into the superpowers deep game, right? So, and then that always creates the clash usually between the two titans. It's just trends, right? I always... It's just like little trends like that. Like, you always want to see that, right? Let me draw here. Draw for my start. Throw him back in Siberia. So swinging on to red. Yellow's thinking here. Yeah, no, I think that's a good move. Go seven and seven, come in with the six. Wow, he's gonna try to. So yellow being very patient here.
So he does decide to take it. Or her, I guess it. They just, whoever it is, decide, Yellows decides to take it. Break Africa as well. Interesting. So he's probably going to hit yellow here. So it's swinging on to blue here. Continue. Draft phase. So I'm swinging on to me. I'm gonna get my card in Irkutsk here. The good thing is I'm gonna have Blue out here who's probably gonna be drawing for his stars. Actually in this in this case, I'm gonna move him all to Irkutsk. But then there's easy ones for red and blue to draw. So this actually turned into a, a decent uh, he forgot white was an AI. Yeah, it's actually been a half decent game so far. Like everyone's playing pretty decent. Dang, yellow with seven stars. See, I almost like there being a present, like a white presence in Africa because. He trades in. He's got that seven in a row. He could, you know, it'd be a rough trade in, but he could potentially eliminate me. gonna push into him. Mm -hmm. 
interesting. You gotta put fast AI on, guy. Yeah. Yeah, it is a good game. It is a good game. I feel like just let. Wait, oh, have it. Yellow's just not letting that happen, right? He keeps breaking them. Swinging on to blue here. Hopefully he's not AFK here, because... This is brutal. Come on. Oh, come on, man. Oh, I just got to tuck in uh tuck in my little ones first. Imagine that someone was like robbing his place or something and it's just like fighting for his life right now. And I'm just... Okay. Blue went bye-bye. No. At least... 
Good news, I have control of the AI. Bad news, there's another AI. <sighs> wow, he's gonna smash yellow too. Yellow has a lot of stars though, so he can easily just... He can just trade in and smash blue here. And retake back Europe easily. Wow, he moves them all in. That is disgusting. That is actually disgusting. Well, that now that blue is an AI, I definitely need to put more here. No losses. Just went to the fast battle. <sighs> so red's still playing tight and not too conservative. So we have that to look forward to. This is good. He's not playing too conservative, right? He's leaving the 15, but he's pushing a decent amount out. Really depends what yellow does now. No, never mind. I take that back. So yellow deciding to do it. gonna break North America. Jump wise, like that blue, damn it, man. Shy Mango, do I have set times for streaming? Uh, basically, 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. You might catch me on. I try to come on daily. Tonight, I've been on all night. But, um, you know, some days I'll take off. But, you know, I don't have a 
actual schedule yet, unfortunately. But I'm gonna so probably start. Uh, I'm gonna start having a schedule down the road here. Like I definitely, I don't have one right this moment, but I'm just saying, 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. I'm gonna try to stream almost daily. So usually around those times, or also just random times. Tonight I just went on a blitz, basically. But um, but down in the future I will. I'll have more scheduled uh, stream times. <laughs> Sorry, and John Paul's just like blue. Damn it, man! Telepat to Xbox. That's so funny, man. Somehow you just knew that was gonna happen, eh? That's LOL. So I'm looking at your guys' comments, I'm not even... Is Yellow still going? What is going on, man? Yep. Okay. I'm trying to understand Yellow's play here. Okay. That's good. He's freeing up some easy ones for me at least. Nice. Perfect. Great. Put himself real thin. Just gonna put all in East Africa and maybe Africa's new home is his new home. So I think he did go for a desperate elimination of white there too, that's what he was doing. I don't think he had like he didn't have that many stars. I didn't, I didn't realize. Did you guys pick that up? How many stars White traded in for there? So what did he have? Eleven. So he traded in for seven. So he had four. Yeah. yeah, I think he was trying to eliminate White for four stars, which he shouldn't have though. Like he couldn't. It was a big risk. Like. There's no need for that. That's why you try to go from all across Europe, North America to there. But I think he did that afterwards. Like, you couldn't get him down in Madagascar. It, like, made no sense. It was weird. I lost a lot.
Blue does have a trade. In. Blue could trade in here, potentially, so. We'll just hit Yarkutsk. A lot of easy ones here now. So swinging on the red, my only competition really. Yeah, blue AI has seven out there soon. Yeah, I'm glad he moved them out. So we get red is playing pretty tight still for I think yellow is actually going to eliminate white here. Yeah, no. No, he just wants to eliminate white. It's, see, it's not for his stars. It's just to eliminate someone, you know what I mean? I don't know. I feel like people get hyped when they, like, eliminate someone, even though... Like, that, that you shouldn't necessarily get hyped on eliminating someone, especially like this, if you're dwindled everywhere. You're going to get two stars, but you get the elimination, you know, you get points or whatever for the league, but. Like, you know what I mean? It's just like you're basically given the game. Yeah. Just sometimes people play for like eliminations and stuff like that, even if it's going to throw them. Did it say white player failed? Blah blah blah. It meant to say yellow. Maybe I just misheard though, and it did say yellow player. Jeez. Well, now blue AI. The good thing is the blue AI sees a bunch of easy ones, and it's gonna go nuts on yellow now. trade-in for the big trade-in.
So what I'm gonna do actually is this. So he has seven stars, so if he trades in, or he's got eight, that's 20. So he could put them off if I break them everywhere. Okay, I have an idea. I know what I'm going to do here. I'm going to break them here. And I'm actually going to break them here up. You know, yellow will probably do that for me, so I don't have to... Actually, you know what? Yeah, I'm just getting my turn here. I'm going back to Siberia. So I know Red has some stars here. He's gonna trade in as well. Wow, he's gonna eliminate that Asia force. That's unfortunate. I should have just pushed them all up. I don't know why I brought them all back. Shoot. So I bet you Blue's going to trade in and he probably is going to put them all on me here now. Shoot. I should have just took North America there, but I thought... Blue would have eight stars, and I didn't want to give my opponents uh, the chance to get take out blue. But now I kind of, I don't know why I left them behind. I should have pushed them in, all in. Stupid. I actually made a big mistake there. Yeah, it's for like league, yeah, league points. But yeah, but it's so weak though. It's like five. Like it wouldn't be worth it. Like I would, I never play for the eliminations. I always play for the the W's because you usually get if you win the game, you usually got at least at least one elimination or two eliminations. You know, <sighs> I'm so stupid. It's all right. He is gonna free me up though. Wow, just lost like five. It's ridiculous. Shoot, I just gotta leave him out there. See, now I'm worried that blue might think that's contesting him, you know, but I need to go for my star here. 
But I don't want to free up his nine either. I had to go there. Six and six. <sighs> yeah, see, it's not worth it though. Five points, like, you're not winning the league on five points every game, you know? You're gonna lose the league if you only get one elimination every. It's just not worth it. So it's like he's going for Blue's elimination as well. It's I don't know. It's not good. He's giving him an easy Asia, you know. Shoot. Thing is, he's opened up. Like realistically, Blue AI should trade in here. Okay, he trades in. Nice. He's. Please don't go south. Nice. No, he's going to go for the easiest targets, right? Which is all in Asia. This is huge for me. Nice. Let's see what... Uh... Nice. I just had 32 there. It's no... Nice, and that's what I mean. He's got a lot of easy, soft targets. Look at all these easy ones. He's going to pick all those up. Nice, yeah, go for that. Nice. This is a huge help for me. That's a nice thing I have in the big numbers. There's, it's just pure deterrent, right? Doesn't quite take Africa. See, I think now is the time. Yeah, I should push for North America here, I, I think. For sure. Probably have...
That's the thing. I don't even want to break your up. That's decent. That's where the funny thing is. I should even do more. Yeah, 17 there. Alright, because I know reds... I have a feeling blue will not break me, but I feel like red might try to break me here. He might have to risk his trade in here. The good thing is, if I do get broken, I do have 5 stars here. Yeah, time to take over. Oh, that was your mistake last game, not eliminating outside Asia Force. Opponent had. Ah, I got you. Yeah, it feels good to have the AI hurt the other player. But I knew, I knew how they, I think, so I know he's going to go out there. He's not going to go against my 20 or 32, because he'll always go for the easiest target. So I knew it was going to go in. Red should have been thinking that and bulked up maybe China, India, strong force. Yeah, it feels real good, <laughs> like you're saying, to see that AI hit him. He, he knows how the AI thinks, though. He, you know, if he's played enough of this risk game, he knows how the AIs are. What's on the red here? He's only got two stars, right? So is he go I think I think red's going for the elimination for points. But now that he's here, he wants to go all the way, I don't know. Nice. It's gonna break Europe for me. Okay, sweet. The funny thing is I left it weak there, no, but now the blue AI is going to... Yep, let's put all Southeast Asia. Or China, that's fine. Oh. He shouldn't have broke gear up there. Blue might have... The thing is, I took a chance by putting 10 there, and blue might have actually came in... So I think he took one or two stars away from yellow there. Red also with five stars now. The thing is now, instead of him getting Europe and potentially putting them all on me, he's going this way now. Like now I could literally I could just keep bulking up and blue would never hit me, you know what I mean? I could give him both continents here, right? And he's not going to hit me. No, I don't want him too powerful. 
like. I am gonna break Europe here. I, I don't, I'll give him Africa. Thing is, there's a lot of reds leaving a lot of easy ones here, right? He's folding all back to. force evenly that's the thing though every turn I hold South America and North America right there's a huge advantage on my so it's on the red That's the thing. I could even just keep playing blue off. I could play blue like, like a, like a, like a whistle, man. I could play him like a. I could play him like just so. I could just play him into red, basically, if I wanted to. I think that's what I'm gonna do, right? Because it just, if red keeps folding, I might as well get blue to keep pushing on him, and then eventually I'm just gonna sweep blue and take. Right? He's got to break me here. He's got to trade in. The good thing is he's playing too tight in Australia, right? And that's the thing. If he keeps leaving easy one, say he gets a star and then he folds him back to Southeast Asia every time. What he should have did is move those onto Mongolia and then trade in and hit me. But now I know how blue works, right? Sure, he has 11 there. Of course he's going to hit a 3. He's not going to hit my 15 though, right? That's why I'm saying I can just play blue onto red this whole time and then slowly just gain the momentum at this point. Now he's boarding him up here because it's lowest force, right? Jeez, how many? He's got 23. I gotta at least take two more here from him. Yeah, how many does he have here? Sorry, 21. So if I take one more.
That's right, I'm gonna put a few over here. Just 18, 20. It's okay. I think Red's gonna make a move here and try to break me. Which is fine because I can just trade in and hit him back, right? You said you hope he doesn't quit, otherwise it's gonna take forever. 21 AI for us, yeah. Yeah, it was all inactive, you know what I mean? Blue freed it up, which makes sense. See how? Yeah, see, bad idea. Don't blank them eight and eight. Right now, that's the easiest target, right? Now, my 18, 20, and 18 aren't the easiest targets. Watch what blue does now. Right? Just a bunch inactive doing nothing. Oh wow, he's gonna trade in and hit me though. Hilarious. He might not break me though. Nice, he's losing him. That's hilarious. He actually traded in and hit me. Yeah, now he's got nothing though, you know. What I need to do here actually is hit Blue's force here. See, now, Blue doesn't really have anywhere to jump. He, In theory, I think Blue, just because he had the big trade-in, he tried to hit me. But in theory, now that he doesn't have a big trade-in and nothing, he would he's going to target Red's 8s. Yeah, swinging on to Red here. So what's Red going to do? He's got the 8 star trading. And he's going to use it. And this is okay. He's going to break me. As long as he loses a decent amount here. Bring him the 20 at least. Bring him the 20 at least. I know the break's coming, but I have the big trade in here too, right? So hopefully he hits me everywhere. And he's gonna fold them all back to Southeast Asia.
Right, now he's gonna ship him east, right? To the easy ones, yeah. All right, now I trade in for huge. Kick right, red right out again. All right, now I just kick red right out. All my opponents don't have any stars. Red's got his buried in Southeast Asia, right? Boom, end my turn. So that's the thing. I'm expecting the break, right? The break comes, but then I have the the trade in for the the counter attack, right? And now he's in trouble, right? Now I'm gonna definitely hold North America and South America this turn, hundred percent. And now I can start playing blue off on red again. Yeah, sorry, you're right, John Paul. I didn't realize he wouldn't hit his eight because I have that easy one. He's in trouble now, though, right? Like after my easy one is gone. Right now, blue's just gonna hurt red for me. He's gonna hurt him again. Let's go 20s around the block. Excuse me. Actually, I should have pushed out in Kamchaka. That's okay. He's still going to hit. It's okay. Just get my star. And my turn. I'll leave the three there, though. See, now Red's in another tough situation where he can't break me, right? But he's got to draw for a star, but by him drawing for a star, it's going to open him up, thin him out. Blue's going to choose targeting him over me. Come on, Red, what's going on here? You know what I mean? Now he's just didn't finish his four to five phase or whatever. All he's got to do is press A or. Come on, man. This kills me, man. This literally kills me.
Come on, man. What a joke. Come on, bro. You know. What? I must have got kicked out of the party. Maybe that's why he's been... Shoot. I think he could hear me for the last little bit. Yeah, I got this one in the bag. This is. I'm glad you. I. I'm glad you're able to tune in, Shy Mango, for your first stream tonight. I am gonna take the W down, but unfortunately, I have to deal with this stuff. Have a good night, man. Thanks for tuning into the stream, and uh, yeah, for the future, man. 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, but I'm gonna have more of a schedule down the road. Uh, I'm just having fun with it. You know what I mean? I streaming. I love streaming. It's so fun. Seems to be my thing. And, uh, yeah. I know, I hate... Yeah. Take care, Shy Mangle. Have a good night, man. I know, I don't know why I get kicked out of party chat. I, that's why I gotta check every time. To make sure I'm still in party chat. You know what I mean? He's probably just like, ah, screw this game and just like left or something, you know? Just so unfortunate. There you go, he finally left. The game's in the bag anyways, I'm just, I'm just playing it really tight. Now that this this is gonna go quick. gonna I'm gonna take Europe and Africa here very very soon right, so let's do it here Do it here. Taking quite a bit of losses there.
Crystal looks like I'm going to take uh, the game down for sure. I mean, we already know that. I'm just going through the motions now. Yeah, I'll pick up the game here. That's not too bad. Actually, at least this was a legit game, you know what I mean? The most legit game of tonight, so... It doesn't really matter at this point. I don't have to do anything anything smart, just full force attack is all that's needed. It's not worth it. It gets five points to eliminate someone. I'm gonna eliminate two players and then get um twenty points for the win. So immediately they're there's 30, like 30 points, right? Over just like chancing to get five points for the league. It's just like, come on. I'm actually losing a lot here. You know, it's not worth it. Five points to dwindle yourself. And then lose the game. Or you could just go for the win with worth 20 points. And you're going to get 25 anyways because you're going to get at least one elimination if you win the game, right? I don't get it. All in all, taking down another W. It's probably the best game tonight, too. Thanks for tuning in all the way to the end, John Paul. It's awesome, man. I appreciate it, brother. GG, finally. <laughs> yes, exactly. Exactly how I was feeling. Finally. Finally took the win. So... Thanks, guys, for tuning in. Please comment, like, and subscribe on YouTube. I'm really trying to get to my goal, 1,000 subs. Um, make sure you guys tune into the stream and watch it on YouTube. And uh, make sure you tune in, either the, the stream or YouTube, whatever you want. But make sure you tune in next time when uh, your boy, Xbox Frequency, takes over the world. All right, guys. Peace out.